another episode of a crazy a town a gaming my name is jonas i'm your host and i'm here with tnt dynamite the explosive one jonas you're the man on the sticks mm -hmm. we're playing that man 21 boy we're browns in dude are we the browns right now yeah, dude, there's a little bit of whiskey in my mouth and a little bit of controller in my this hand is <laughs> why is there whiskey in your mouth this is That's how you need to handle the Browns, dude, because they're sad. You got to cope with depressants. They won their last game, though, Jonas, right? They played the Bengals, dude. What do that mean? A win's a win's a they win, They played Jones. the Bengals, It's dude. a professional football team. At any point in time, There's any team could beat any of, team. Uh, foot professional football team. Professionals yeah. in quotations. Are you? Oh, wait, hold on, Jonas. Wait. Are you saying is that at any time one team could beat another team is not a true statement? The, well, we're talking about college. On a dog's ass sometimes. You're right, dude. I'm just saying is that I've seen the Browns beat the beat, beat like number one seeded teams before. Yeah, they beat the Patriots one time in Cleveland. Okay, yeah. they whooped their A too. They're up like 14 to nothing in the first quarter. And that's that's what I mean by in football, any team can beat any team because we're these are still like the top tier players in the country. You know, not like college ball where it can just be like, oh, well, this is going to be. They got like three good guys and everybody else is like high school level. Yeah, this is going to be a 50-point blowout and there's just nothing you can do about it. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, I threw an interception, Baker. Well, yeah, I mean, dude, it is. I mean, you're you're right. Perfect. It is. I mean, that is kind of the motto is any given Sunday. Exactly. On any given Sunday. Um, and, oh, we're down 14 nothing. Speaking of losing. Um, yeah, dude. So, I mean, yeah. I mean, I guess they did win last last time. Yeah, man. Go Brownies. Well, by the time this video comes out, there'll be another game. Or and they're going to win that game, too, Jonas. I'm putting it even, in the book. Oh, they play, the, they play football team this week. They play Washington. We won. That's a win. That's a win. That's an easy, easy W. It should be. TNT Dynamite. Future me right now. Boom. Good job for the Browns. You're that's like, two games. The Browns won this past week playing football team. <laughs> that's two games they've won this week, so far early in the season yeah dude if they go two and one that's i mean they might as well be in the playoffs we're gonna make the playoffs this year we are um in this season gonna be down by three touchdowns soon <laughs> just letting you know what's happening right now i mean you're this. playing the raiders they're hard uh <laughs> the raiders oh, are I got sacked again, <laughs> yep, that's cool we're already first quarter three minutes into the game we're down by a billion points it's, you know jonas What's a billion, but like a one with a bunch of zeros, you know? Exactly, dude. In one second, it could be a million. Think of it like this. If you put those zeros before the one, boom, right? Whoa. Whoa. Did I just Whoa. blow your mind? Whoa, dude. It goes from like a very large number to, to a this. very small number. Yeah, we're down by three touchdowns. We're going to lose. The Welcome <laughs> to lose town. In the first quarter. No, I guess it's the second quarter. Yeah, dude, we're good. This gives you less time to <laughs> compensate. I know, right? Yeah, dude, I gotta like, I gotta like focus. No more jokes. Nah, there's jokes. Wow, dude, I'm just <laughs> getting crushed like a bee out here. There's definitely gonna be jokes. Yeah, dude, we'll see if I can come back. we never. I don't think I've ever come back from 21 down. They're just having a rousing, just little. They're doing some horseplay on the sidelines and at your expense. Oh. <laughs> wow, dude, I almost. Ooh, they're not right about home here, dude. <laughs> Good job, Jones. <laughs> need a sip of whiskey to handle that one, dude. I have faith in you. I got it, dude. Don't worry. <laughs> so, uh, when was the last time you had macaroni? Mm. Mm. Their defense is rude. Dude. I don't, you know what, Jonas? You know, since, since I've had stomach issues, I'm, I'm like a little apprehensive about eating anything with dairy in it. Oh, yeah. I could, I could imagine, dude, if I started having dairy issues, I would not want to eat dairy either. I would want to. But like I would be, I would be lenient, so or tentative, I guess. So I would have to say it's like, all right. So here's like early, 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 early dynamite. Like my mom is lactose intolerant, my brother is lactose intolerant, my sister's lactose intolerant, grandmother, grandfather, everybody's lactose intolerant. My so mother, it's not a new thing. No, no, no. But my mother didn't tell me at an early age that this was a potentiality because it's it's a hundred percent hereditary. You're gonna pass it on. Right. Um, so I remember like I would eat oatmeal in the morning or I would eat cereal with milk. She used to buy gallons of milk and I was the only person in the household drinking it. And I was like, I don't understand why that's a thing. And she was like, well, I can't drink it. I'm lactose intolerant. This didn't happen until I was in like the fifth grade. 
So I didn't even know that I was lactose intolerant. I would just go to school farting in my pants. Right, dude. Like drinking milk at lunch and all that stuff like all kids do at school, dude. So like in the third grade, Jonas, I actually... This is sad, Jonas. In the third grade, they used to call me stinky because I farted all the time. I think you mentioned this before, dude, and I really felt your pain. (laughs) Well, it's all right. We're going to re-mention it. But yeah, they used to call me stinky because I farted all the time, Jonas. It used to hurt. It used to hurt a lot. I bet, and, dude. And I was, and I You're remember, like, why? I remember coming home and I was like, "Mom, I don't know. I just keep farting all the time at school." She was like, "Hmm. Well, I'm lactose intolerant, so there's a good chance you may be too." I'm like, "What the hell, lady? <laughs> what are you talking? Father, what have you been doing to me? You've been feeding me condensed milk in my." And my oatmeal, which is delicious. Like, I drink, I eat oatmeal now with just water, and I'm going to tell you right now. Not nearly as good. Yeah, putting that carnation, heavy, you know, light, light cream or whatever in your, in your, in your oh, oatmeal. Oh, that's like whole milk. That's like full cow squirts, dude. <laughs> it was that carnation. Uh, it used to come yeah, in a you can. Just and just have an udder in here and just like... I mean, straight from it, dude. That's what the thick stuff is, bro. It's it was like, it wasn't heavy cream, no. But yes, I get you. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not, I'm not gonna suck a cow's teat if that's what you're saying. I mean, don't knock it till you try it, dude. Uh, I'm good. Like I'll knock it. Don't worry. The thing, I don't know, man. And now that I look at, at back at it, like milk is kind of kind of weird in that in that sense. And we are just like taking cow juice, like literally. Cow yeah. juice. Oh, dude, it's the juice of a cow, dude. <laughs> yeah, like it's meant for baby cows, not necessarily for people. And we're just yeah, like, like oh, we're we, good. Um, would we, as humans, what the f was that? He just basically threw a, um, you know, let me like, you know, why don't we just use human milk instead of cow milk? That at least is more like, right? Beneficial to like, and that's not even for like. Give like my sister a job, dude. She could just like go sell her milk. <laughs> Broke ass sitting at home all day. She go sell her titty milk. <laughs> <laughs> you can't, you can't, you can't say titty milk. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure we're like three minutes in. Yeah, but you dude, can't. we're good. We're like, <laughs> you can't, you can't she just, wants to sell it on the internet, dude. Like, let her do it, dude. She'll make some cash. You can't, you can't just be throwing titty milk out there like that. You can't do that. All right, we're gonna, legal, gonna have to bring this back so, onto <laughs> the rails. <laughs> I know you get excited. Uh, dude, I, I take stuff off a cliff. And you like you like you like your little profane words. <laughs> oh, whatever, dude. Breast milk from the human oh, of my sister's okay. little breast. There you go. Don't talk about your sister's breast over the channel either, you weirdo. <laughs> what the hell? You're me. way too comfortable talking about your sibling's uh, mammary glands. That's dude, just... she has doesn't have those. We just know well, that's mainly because you don't have a sister. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> but I'm not cool. I have a sister, and I would never. Oh, that's be why t- I use sister, because I don't. I wouldn't say mom. That's. that's oh, what? what the, why would you even go there? Because I don't. It there? I'm no, not taking it there, dude. I'm <laughs> taking, <laughs> that's why I use your mom's breast. Why use sister? Because I don't have one, dude. It doesn't exist. Mm-hmm. You see, my aunt. I don't have one of those either. See oh. how I do that, dude? Yeah. I use things I don't have, and it's yeah. not real, and I can make it as gross as I want. I mean, I guess. What about, uh, yeah, like my, like we could use, <laughs> we could use my, self, my self-respect my uh, self milk, dude. <laughs> <laughs> my, my will to live milk. <laughs> I'm fully comfortable joking about things that don't exist, like my sex life. <laughs> my sex life milk. <laughs> <laughs> Get it? There's none of that. <laughs> My love of nature milk. (laughs) My kindness milk. (laughs) My empathy for human souls milk. All that, you know? (laughs) My belief in religion milk. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, My our subscriber milk. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, guys, we're gonna use all your milk, huh? Because you don't exist. <laughs> like this. By the way, we're tied. <laughs> I, I like, came back. Twenty-one, like, nothing. I like this. Ain't got nothing on the CBs, dude. <laughs> this Talking was... about all that milk got me flowing. But uh, yeah, so then I stopped drinking milk, Jonas, well, and yeah, dude, uh, I, I won't blame you. For that. That's but dramatic. just just recently, I did have some issues where some gas got up in my my system. 
Because yeah. lactose intolerance is essentially just like you can't digest. Tune in to next week's podcast because I fully want to talk about how you tainted my Instagram feed by our conversation. On our oh, are we talking about that? Not now. They got to tune in. No, I mean, are we talking? About I figure I'd bring it up. Dude. All right, that's fine. I mean, not like about your issue, just in general. I mean, we can bring up my issue. You can just say you had a stomach pain. Well, I'm bringing up the issue now. All right, that's good. We'll do that. <laughs> that was this. Spoiler alert. Turn there's, into there's episode. No I don't know what number. <laughs> what we'll talk about, about Instagram ads. I don't know what you. What, no, we're not talking about that. I'm talking about my issue. <laughs> my stomach was effed up because I don't know. I went to I went to like the, the grocery store and I bought like a sandwich and it had some cheese on it, dude. It had a lot of cheese on it. And I ate it and it was is good. So I get I get it. Oh, dude. And like once you have gas is trapped in your system, it can be painful. Jones. Yeah, it dude, sucked. I've definitely had uh, gas pains in my intestines. You've had gas pains before? Like not often, but like sometimes, like when I get like the bubble guts, dude. Like it, it hurts, dude. I get it, and I imagine that's what you were feeling. Like that, all that pressure in your intestines. It feels like someone is jamming a screwdriver into your loins. Uh, yeah, it was to the point where like, honestly, it'd been for like a couple of days, but I just kind of lived with it, and then I'm like, you know. I'm a male, so if I experience like pain or something, I'm just like, oh, I guess this is my life now. <laughs> yes, I just have... dude, it was straight. It just didn't land, dude. It just wanted to tie the game. You don't get the tie of the game. I blew it, dude. I blew it. Yeah, it sucks. Dude, that was all my fault. Anyways, we came back for a 21 point deficit to lose. Um, but yeah, dude, I'm sorry that your stomach hurt. Man. It doesn't hurt anymore. I'm good now. You fixed it. Yeah, but I was just convinced that I'd just live in pain for the rest of my life. I was fine with that, too. Oh, I definitely caused the loss now. That's like <laughs> when my shoulder hurt, and I was just like, this is my life now. Yeah, I'm telling you. I'm just like, well, this is my life now. Pain forever. Yeah, so my word to the wise out there, with, with if, you know, if you're older or if you are ever in pain, it, it doesn't have to be your life now. Note to self, the second we stopped talking about milk, we went down by 17 more points. <laughs> Wait, Milk what? was my lifeblood. I mean, I don't think there's a correlation. To that. Oh, I think, I think when I had milk on the brain, I was, I was in a zone. No, you don't. You don't want to talk about my guts. You want to? Yeah, your guts have made me lose. Your, your uh, disgust of my milk conversation has brought me much joy. I have a little fart in my system right now. I could let out for you. Uh, you think that'll help? Maybe we should try it. What? Since we're just, you know, since milk made you win, maybe if I fart in your mouth. <laughs> I don't want your milk. It might help make you win, John. It gives you superpowers. Your milk is not what I need to live, friend. He didn't even jump. What a pee, dude. I'm just saying, dude. Like, if you never had anybody fart in your mouth, you don't you know what it... Lived. I guess, note to self, I don't want to live. You don't know what, what it could do for you. What if yeah, that? Give me that pass interference. We lost, bro. Uh, yeah, that was pretty much the truth. I can't believe I came all the way back just to lose. I'm a trash person. <laughs> Sad about that. I'm just wondering if, like, what if the cheat code to getting superpowers is something that somebody is just like, I'm not letting anybody do that to me. I mean, it depends what it would be. I probably would let somebody do it. Like, what if I just punched you in your balls and then you could fly like Superman? Oh, uh, that would totally be worth it, dude. That's like, I mean, yeah, that, but that when's sucks. the last? That pain sucks, but like, when's the last time you've been punched in the balls? I've never been punched. In the balls. Hey, thank you. So, how do you know it's not the cheat code? We gotta try. We gotta test these things out first. Yeah, dude. If you can, I'll let. I'll, I'm more agnostic about that. So, like, about getting if, punched if someone, in the balls? If someone, <laughs> if someone proved to me that like getting punched in the balls would like make me a superhero. I'd be okay with it, but I'm not going to be the science. Well, funny enough, Joe, I don't know if I'm agnostic to getting punched in the balls. I'm pretty sure I'm just, like, anti-getting punched in the balls. Like, I'm 100% against getting punched in the balls. Anti-ball punch? Yeah, I never want to be punched in the balls ever. Yeah, well, we're only down by three now, but there's only 20 seconds left, so we're going to lose. I've noticed that. Yep, we lost by three. Damn it. If we would have made that field goal, it would have been tied, you cuck. Yeah, you should have made that field goal, dude. I know, dude. That's why I suck, dude. It was, I'm cutting the kicker after this game. You're, cut, you're cutting him? You mean you? You're cutting yourself? I don't play for the Browns. I'm pretty sure you control them in every way. Nope. That is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you've already done that, he does Twitch. TNT Dynamite. I'm on Twitch every single day. That's TNT D I N O M I G H T underscore Crazy Town at Twitch.tv. And racism on the back of their helmet. 
good. All right, yeah. Is that a problem? <laughs> no, they should. I was just surprised that it was on there. Um, because, you know, the NFL hated Colin Kaepernick. And like, racism. I heard he's in the next. Here he's in this game, actually. He might be, dude. But for Jonas, we'll catch you on the next one. We uh, are out. Uh,